Us again. Again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's raining. <laughs> yeah. We don't like rain. It's cold. Yeah. yeah, so because it's raining, we're going a different way than we normally we, do. Yeah, because there's like trees that we can hide underneath. In case any of you were wondering, you know we are psycho, right? We have led down in the middle of this road. Look, it's like a road. Yeah. Yeah, we've led down on the floor in the middle of no, it before. No, it was just a bit up there. Yeah, we'll show you and when then, we get there. And then these, um, this, like, these two people came and they walked and they were like, Are you girls okay? <laughs> they actually came and spoke to us and gave us this really weird look. We get weird looks a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like rain because it fucks up my hair. And I said that word again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Anyway, I don't like rain. Um, we actually do have a topic today that really? we planned. We actually wrote it down on a yeah, piece of paper. Oh, there's a car. Oh, there's, there's, a, a, car. Car. there's a car. Come on. Side. Let's go there because there's a bit we can stand on. Okay. Come here. Alright. <laughs> Help me. This way, up here. Come on. Misty. There we go. There's a car. Hello, car. Alfie, no. Alfie, come on. I don't know what's up. Okay. Alright, Alfie, if you promise to behave, I'll let you off for a bit. You know there's a problem right there. Maybe not yet, then. <laughs> My hair is not being eaten. <laughs> Alright, so, our topic, I'm going to let Sammy introduce, because I introduce a lot of topics. <laughs> Yeah, well, we were, like, sitting in the library at lunchtime, and then we got kicked out, like, the library, sort of. <laughs> well, we got kicked out of our space. Yeah. And then we nearly got kicked out of the library altogether, but because of people jumping on top of people. Yeah, don't do that when there are two girls sat on a window ledge. We like sitting on that window ledge. Yeah, you're stealing our window ledge! So you guys can... <laughs> you understand what I mean? You're not going to say it again. Then. You can something off. <laughs> oh, I've got, got, got a hole in my jumper. Look. Yeah? All right, so our topic was, um, while we were staring mesmerized what? out of the window at cute guys from our school, yeah. we what were, are the best qualities in a guy? Like, now, we're going to go... For... And looks. All right, now let's go for looks first, because looks are the easiest. I'm being dragged backwards. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so looks. Not a personal opinion on looks. It yeah. It doesn't necessarily mean for all girls, but this is our opinion. Yeah. And like, it can change. This is like, we're going to give you quite a, like, broad opinion. So like, we're not going to be specific. Yeah. Alright, hair colour doesn't matter too much, but if you have blonde highlights or something stupid <laughs> like that, then really, yeah, oh, natural yeah. hair colours, please. Yeah, natural hair. Natural. Unless it goes, like, green or something. Yeah, if your hair's green, then, you, then you're permitted to dye it. Yeah. But I don't know anyone whose hair's naturally green, do you? No. Oh, no, 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 no. I know someone, and the hair is, like, brown, but, like, when it's, like... When the sun catches it, it goes, like, green. Okay. Well, there we have it. Someone with green hair. <laughs> um, well, yeah, so natural hair colours. If you're grey, then... Yeah, you, yeah, you can dye your hair. But, yeah, natural hair. Don't bleach your hair. You look gay. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're trying to attract men, don't do that. <laughs> um, um, also, your hair has to be of a reasonable length. But I like long hair. Yeah, well, me and Sammy both prefer long hair. Yeah. But, like, most girls, the vast majority of girls, like you to have a decent length of hair. And if we put it like this, your hair has to be long enough to have your have a girl's fingers run through it and for oh her to be able God. to grip onto it. And that gives like me that. shivers. That actually gives me shivers. Don't, don't, don't. <laughs> don't. This is like one of my turn-on things. No, leave my hair alone. I don't want to be turned on by you right now. We're on video. We can't. So, yeah. Um, stop it. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Oh, oh, God, I just your hair that. must be long enough for your hair to be held. But for us. For us. 
you do get people who like bald cuts and like all sorts of stuff, but our personal opinion is you need hair. Yeah. Alright, Alfie, you have to stay close. <laughs> no! <laughs> That's the wrong way! I told you <laughs> Come on! Um, Alfie! Right, so let's I am going to get my Alfie Tourette's again. Alright, Alfie's now going to be our new swear word. Alfie! <laughs> that sounds <laughs> perfect timing. Alfie! Alfie! Stop peeing on the farm. Alfie! Alfie! This is where thingy goes. Do you want to walk up here? No, there's a person there. Person walking this way with the dog. 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 Alright, let me get Alfie on the lead then if there's a dog. Can you hold this for a minute? Yeah. Alright, okay. so you carry on with the So, what's the next thing? Eyes, I think Yasmin's preferred eye colour is brown. Yeah, my preferred eye colour, but I don't mind green and stuff. Yeah. I don't, eyes, you just, eyes, as long as you don't have like, really weird eyes. Like, weird shaped eyes. Yeah, eye colour's not such a big thing. No. Um, but as well, like, curly eyelashes is cute. Yeah, it is. It really is. Yeah. But don't go curling but, your eyelashes. Yeah, don't go curling no. your eyelashes. No. Straight <laughs> eyelashes can be cute as well. Yeah. Depends on, like, your it depends, it depends on the other facial features. Yeah, it depends on the rest features. of your face. So eyes are, like, quite... Unless you have stupid eyes, they're quite broad. Um, yeah. Um, what else? All right, I have a thing. So do quite a few girls, but Sammy doesn't have this thing. I have a thing about, like, the shape of, like, the bottom of your face. Like... Most guys have quite a masculine-y kind of jaw shape. Yeah, doesn't seem to bother me. I like, a, I like a very broad jaw. And so do quite a few guys. Another one I've heard is girls like guys with no, like, a specific kind of nose. <laughs> this doesn't really bother me, to be honest, but... Yeah, you've got a freak about nose. Huh? You've got a freak about nose. Yeah, I do know someone who actually has... Thing about noses, like they won't go out with someone unless they have a decent nose. But I can't say on YouTube. Sorry, people. If I get fifty comments, I'll say, <laughs> which we're not going to get with only sixty-three views. <laughs> uh, but like, yeah. So there's that. Also, all right. The height. 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 Some girls like short guys. Yes. The vast majority of girls prefer you to be tall. Sorry, girls, short guys. Sorry, short guys. But you will grow. You will grow. grow. And, well, unless you're old. But, yeah. um, but also... You shrink. Yeah. But then also, there are short girls. So short guys go for short girls. Yeah, it's just... It's like... It tends to... It tends to it's just like... It's nice to have a guy taller than you. Yeah. I mean, there is nothing better to, than when you're hugging someone to, like, reach up. Or to like have to look up to see them. Exactly, Yasmin. Yeah, that's why I like hugging Sammy yeah. so much because she's so much taller than me. Um, I'm like half a head taller than you. Yeah, she is. Yeah, and like one of my friends is like literally a whole head taller than me. Every time I hug him, it's just like, oh my uh, god, uh, lush. And he's an amazing. And he is a good hugger. hugger. We have done an. We've done like. We've done, one, we've done one on hugging, haven't we? Yeah, we've done. Yeah, one. he is an amazing hugger. Yeah. Um, also, like, build. Like, alright, so this literally depends on the girl. It really does. Okay, because. Yeah. Ideas on that one. Because Sammy doesn't mind, like, lanky guys. And you get, like, lanky guys, you get lanky but strong guys. You get, you get, like, really built guys. Alfie, what are you doing? Seriously, what are you doing? <laughs> That dog's weird. Um, Alright, you're going off the lead for a minute. I don't seem to mind, really, because, like, I like guys that are bigger. And I like guys that are, like... Smaller. I don't like guys who are, like, on steroids. No. That's yeah, don't do that. No. no, don't over-pump, either. If you pump to the point where you look like you're on steroids, ow, you've gone too far. Yeah. Okay, like, it's just... A girl has yeah, to be able to good. reach around you. And it has to be able to, but like, and yes. you have like midget 
arms. Like, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah. Alright, like, average arm length is about my arm length, because Sammy has long arms. Do I? Yeah. See, look at the difference in our arm lengths. <laughs> it's more than a hand. But, um, like, alright, strong arms is nice, so you can, alright, so you can, like, work out your arms and stuff. But not like not, big. not too obsessive. Just like enough so that you have some kind of shape to it and not too much flab to it. Ow! Can you hold the phone for a second? Yeah. Alfie! So, yeah, that's another thing. What's another, what's another thing? Let's be quiet for a minute because I know if you're coming up. Oh, style. Oh, yeah, style. Oh. Yeah. You don't have to follow what everyone else is wearing, all right? AKA chinos. Yeah, I did. Uh, I did. I did get bought over by the chinos thing, but I didn't. I've always hated chinos. I freaking hate the menaces now. They're horrible. Right, they're they're horrible. Just too commercialised, and especially the ones that are like elasticated at the bottom. Yeah, too many people wear them. That you just, you just. There is nothing style-wise. There is nothing sexier than a guy. In jeans, jeans and like a shirt with the button with the top oh, buttons on them. Nice. Oh, that's freaking! Oh, that is just lush. Yeah, that is. Right. So yeah, if you're ever going on a date and you have then and you have the equipment to wear jeans and a shirt, which means you need jeans yeah. and a shirt. But like, oh, not the like underwear. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not like a proper shirt, but like you know one of them casual shirts. Uh, yeah, I tend not to like wear a lot. Yeah. Yeah, not like a not like a really like expensive like work shirt or a school no. shirt. Just like a you can get them from most shops. H and M's good actually. Yeah, for men's clothes uh, and girls' clothes. I've seen I've seen quite a few nice ones at Primark. Yeah, yeah. If you can't afford H and M, Primark is good. Yeah, Primark's good. Also, I practically live also... in Primark. Okay, cheap. Yeah, cheap. Yeah. I love that word. <laughs> also. Or clearance you need, or sale. Yeah. Oh. You also need to have like a fluffy jacket. Not a jumper, a jacket. A zip jacket. Because I'm telling you, if it gets... Alright, guys have this smell that is just lush. Oh, that and smell. once it gets your smell, any girl will be irresistible to your jacket. I'm not joking. I have, nicked, get that smell. I have nicked boys' jackets because of that smell. Okay? So I wanted to nick her brother's jacket because he smelled of it. I know, literally. I nicked my boyfriend's jacket because it smelled like that. Then I and I actually her. hugged it all night. Then I nicked it from her. You didn't get it over the night. Ha. Yeah, but I got it one where I came round your house for a sleepover. Yeah, fair play. Ha. No, it's just absolutely lush. And, like, when it's cold, if you put your jacket round a girl, there's, like, the most romantic thing in the world. We'll get on to that, like, romance and stuff when we get to personality. Yeah. Is there anything else in looks? Oh, don't do this thing. I've noticed a lot of boys recently have started wearing clear lip gloss to make their lips look shinier. No. If you, if that's the kind of thing to, but, you know. Most of the time, no. You do need soft lips. Yeah. So you don't need super shiny, like, girl lips. <laughs> Believe me, we have enough girl lips. We are girls. That's starting to sound wrong. Let's change that subject. <laughs> Girl lips. Oh, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> <Girl> lips. <laughs> if you're under me here, girl lips, in any of the videos, that's why. <laughs> um, so, one with the girl lips. This is going to be the one with the girl lips. <laughs> Alright, sorry, we're like figuring out our episode title. Um, <coughs> so, no. Yes. Yeah, don't be a fashion. Cheap. Yeah, don't. Yeah, really don't. Individuality is good. Yeah. Also, don't put too much gel in your hair. Because no, girls no. like to stroke your hair, and gel makes it really awkward. Yeah. Girls like to stroke hair. Well, we, we do. Well, most girls like hair. Okay. Most That's girls not. like to play with That's your hair. This is gonna sound <laughs> wrong. Okay. This is the hair on your head, <laughs> not anywhere else. Most girls like to play with your hair on your head, so make it accessible. If you absolutely have, oh for God's sake! If you absolutely have to put 
put gel in it. Make sure it's like a thin layer, thin enough that you, it's not going to like, your hair is not rock solid. Oh, one thing that we do want to know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <Don't look. laughs> Sorry. Okay. One thing we do want to know is what guys actually find attractive. Yes. If anyone can do a video response of what guys find attractive, you will be like worshipped. Yeah. You we get... really want to know, and quite a few people want to know. Well. And considering we're giving you all these tips, yeah. come on, boys. <laughs> Please. <laughs> um, so. Or if you're, like, lesbian. And sh yeah. Yeah, anyone, like, respond with how to get, like, if you're gay, respond with how to get a guy. And if you're les, respond with how to get and a girl. And if you're straight, respond with how to get a girl. Because it's all different depending on sexuality. Yeah. It really and is. Oh, you're opinion yeah just if you disagree or agree with anything we've said then just comment yeah. you know tell us we like to hear feedback yeah really we do yeah, and also we like it. it makes us feel loved yeah even, even, if, if, even if you say we're completely wrong we still feel loved yeah even if you say that we're shitheads that should be like Locked put in up. jail we still will love you yeah because you commented you've shown us appreciation it's just a point. Um, oh, look at the horse. Aww. Look at the horse, look, look, at the horse. look at how beautiful it is. <laughs> no, Alfie, you don't get to stroke the horsey. Okay, Alfie's stronger than me. Alright, so, should we move on to personality? Yeah. If we think of anything else, we'll add it. Yeah. All right, personality. First and foremost, if you are unkind to girls or guys, you, you'll you you're not. You you won't even get considered. And you'll change someone. Huh? There's a hole in this one as well. You'll change someone? As in change someone, as in if they were really nice before. Yeah. You're an absolute idiot to them. Yeah, you'll start change. Yeah, believe me, like, how you treat people changes them. Now, that doesn't mean that if you, next time you see a nice guy or a horrible guy, you're going to be mean to them to swap them. It just means that you need to be nice to people, because as well, if you're a guy that goes around, like, making fun of girls, making fun of other guys, picking fights with people, being mean to teachers as well, I mean, yeah, sometimes a bit of banter's fun, but know when to draw the line, seriously, because it starts to get, like... Sometimes it's funny, yeah. Sometimes it's funny until an extent. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. There is an extent where banter is no longer banter. And, and it's just mean. To trip you over. Yeah. I think Misty wants to walk next to Alfie, to be honest. Yeah. I think Alfie wants to walk wherever Hallie oh, can. Oh, no, no, Misty wants to walk in front, that's all. <laughs> I think Alfie just wants to walk all over the place. Oh, so that kind of... Oh. Um, Ow. Ow. So, if we you, if we just say... I just got hit in the head with a spiky thing. <laughs> Alright, that kind of just comes under the generalised term, which I know is stupidly generalised, and everyone's going to ask, what do we mean by this? But, be kind. I mean, yeah, I know, it's so easy to just say, yeah, I'm a kind person. But... So don't say stuff like... You look fat. Unless, look, but you also have to be honest. But yeah. Don't say it as in you look fat. If that's actually fat, say, so, say it in a nice way. So like, that's not exactly flattering on you or something like yeah. that. You know, you have to be honest and there is an extent where being kind is too far. I will admit that. Yeah, when you're ass kissing. Yeah, when you're ass kissing, it's not fun. That's just, that's There's just... There's a train! Train! <laughs> Yeah, anyway, that's just that's just a turn off if you're just oh, asking. The train. No, the train's a turn off too, but yeah, if you were having sex on a train track, the train would be a really big turn off. Um, Alfie, stay close. Unless you're into that kind of thing. Stay away from Alfie! The train. Sorry, I sound like some kind of evil hag. Ow! Yeah, he was going to run onto the train track. Yeah. If that's impossible, because I don't think it is. 
Oh, I'm sure he could find a way. Alfie, stay close. Alfie. All right, let's carry on before we start talking about hitches, because that could get sick-minded. Okay, so what else is this? Um, if a guy is romantic. All right. Romantic and soppiness come sort of together. All right? And sensitivity. And sensitivity. Like, all right, you have to be sensitive, like, sweet, like, all right, yeah, everyone says it's, like, not much to cry in front of a girl, but actually it's kind of makes you more manly. Yeah. It, it shows trust. It shows trust and it shows love and it shows that you actually have a romantic and you have an emotive bone in your body. I <laughs> yeah. No, so, fault. Yeah, so like, that's one. Another would be like, okay, do romantic things. Like, go out with your girlfriend or with your crush or something. I mean, sometimes, alright, I know. Or even I didn't just be your friend. Yeah, even just, if you've got a friend who's a girl who's single, who's like, or even if she's not single, you can still be nice. Yeah, just be nice to her, because girls, even if it's their friend, they love to be treated like, you know, like, romantically, because it just makes them feel loved, and girls really do feel unloved sometimes. Yeah, I felt unloved. No matter. I felt unloved today as well. Because the person that normally makes me feel loved was in isolation. And the person who normally makes me feel loved wasn't in school. Yeah, well, he don't make you feel loved. No, not really. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, the person who stinks. I know he does. Um, uh, <laughs> but, like, yeah, any girl loves to be made to feel loved. Yeah, even, yeah. Just, right. Even if you're friends. Yeah. No, I know I didn't. Flirt, don't don't, mm -hmm. don't flirt if you're friends. Do you like take them out and like be nice? But don't like flirt. don't Alfie! flirt. Alfie! Alf! So then, uh, no. So if you're going out with someone, don't flirt with other people. Yeah, if you're going out with someone, don't flirt with other people, especially in front of them. Believe me. Yeah. Believe me. <laughs> I know. I've I've seen her get extremely jealous. And she's seen me get jealous. Yeah. Um, I've gotten jealous for her before. I've gotten jealous for her before Jack. as well. How are her? That's right, that's Jack. Yeah. Um, uh, we just saw someone we knew. Um, let's keep walking. Uh, alright. I know I didn't do this with my current boyfriend, so if you ever watch, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it's nice to, like, date a girl before you be in a relationship. Because I've done that with my exes, and it's just... It's nice to feel, like, to, like, get yourself all, like, done up and, like, go out and... We can still do that when you're in a relationship. Yeah! I'm hinting to you! Hinting to... Hint. I'm hinting to you! <laughs> Me? <laughs> I'm hinting to your boyfriend! Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I was pointing at you! Okay. you. And, yeah. and your boyfriend, actually. You could do with going out. But yeah, if you can, taking a girl out, when you're going out or anything, just time with the two of you is so important because... And she really misses. Yeah. It is so, so important. I get, I, get, I get when she's in a soppy mood, I get all that. So thank she you. She gets all the Yeah, thank she gets you. all the love. Thank you, Callum. <laughs> um, so like, it's just about... Alfie, come here. Alfie! Alfie! Alfie, come here. Alfie, Alfie, come here. What are you doing? God's sake, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so yeah. We went the awkward side then. Maybe I should um, put him on the lead now. Yeah, Hold that, please. Yeah. So, yeah, that's... It's, Anyway, what's the next thing? Uh, so yeah, that in time. Um, um, sense of humour. Yes, yeah, sense of humour. Alright, you have to be kind of funny and jokey. That comes up. Yes, bantering. But things like sexism or no. 
Oh. No prejudice, no homophobia, no... Yeah, homophobia, that word. Yeah. I've got it then. <laughs> no prejudice at all. No, really, definitely no sexism. No. Or racism or anything. If you do that, you're going a good way to get slapped. Yes. Or castrated. Yeah, because we considered castrating someone today. Yeah, because he wouldn't leave us alone. <laughs> he wouldn't leave us alone. So don't annoy. Don't annoy right. people. This has to be said. If a girl is in a stupidly bad mood, be nice to her, because it usually means it is her time of the month. Oh, and do not turn around and ask her if she's on. Don't. If you think it, just think, think just, it. Just, just think it. Ask her friends if you really have to know. Because asking her, or even like telling her stuff about it or something, if you are yeah. told, is not fun. You are going the right way to be slapped or strangled or abused Murdered. in some kind of way. Murdered. Murdered. That's a good one. Yeah. Murdered. But, um, yeah. Uh, but you, have a sense of humour. If someone is teasing you, come up with something back to say, don't freak out, don't start throwing punches, don't be stupid. Um, yeah, not fighting. No, really, fighting's no. It stopped raining, I've just it stopped raining ages ago, but I just realised. I know, do you know what the time is? Um, just checking. At 20 to 5, what time you got to? I got to half five. Alright, we'll be fine then. Um, so yeah, there's that. Uh, also making a girl laugh. Girls yeah. love to be made to laugh. It's like... Don't make a girl cry, though. Don't make a girl cry. If you make... That's happened to me several times. It's happened to me, too. And it's just like, every time you make a girl cry... She's like, seen me. I know. And I've seen her. So. Every time you make a girl cry, no, it's like... Alright, if you imagine a girl's love to you is like a rope. Okay? No, no it's like a rope. Yeah. And every time you make her cry, one of those itty bitty threads in the rope goes. Goes. Just disappears. Okay? And the rope gets thinner and thinner and thinner until it's at the point where it could just snap. Okay? And trust. Trust also comes into that. You have to be trustworthy. And if you do something to make a girl not trust you, you have to earn it back. And earning a trust back is not a conversation via text. Not pointing any fingers. <laughs> but it's not. Okay? It takes a while. It does. And believe me, a relationship with no trust is... Pointless. And it's stupidly difficult. All that's in your mind is what they're doing like paranoia and believe me if your girl is paranoid and crying and emotional wreck i mean if a girl really loves you she'll put up with that for a certain amount of time but then it'll get to the point where she will realize that she has to put herself first and in relationships you do you have you can't lie well, yeah, yeah, you yeah. have to be happy yeah. that's another thing if you're not happy in a relationship you have to say so yeah. There is nothing worse than finding out Good. when it, when than finding out too late that your spouse whatever isn't happy in the relationship. Well, he turns out to be gay. Yeah. If you're gay, please don't mess with the girl's feelings. Really. So yeah, that's the serious stuff. Anyway, let's go on to fun stuff. All right. You have to give your girl attention, and I mean in that oh, way. Oh, what? Huh? Huh? Fun stuff. Yeah. yeah. All right, girls, you have Fun. to respect them, but you do have to be close. Fun stuff. If you get what we mean. Fun stuff. Otherwise, girls will start to get bored, and then they will start to get flirty. Oh. And they'll end up kissing someone. They'll be horny, and they'll end up kissing someone random. And then that leads to problems. Yeah. Should we stop talking about depressing stuff now? Yeah, let's. All right. There's a packet there. Oh, yeah. By the way, if anyone, like, thinks of any video topics, within reason, if you send us an email, comment, whatever, our email address, which is now our joint account, so we just have yeah. one email address, 
um, is orangegreent5 at gmail.com. So if you just email us there, both of us will get it. Just if you want to speak to one of us in specific, write the name. If it's both of us, then write just... the name in the subject. Yeah, write the name in the subject. Um, if because not, if it's something you don't really want both of us to be reading, then yeah. yeah. But if you want, if you want us both to see it, just say, just say hey or something in the subject, whatever you want or that, and then just send us an email. I mean, it can be anything, whether it's a comment, whether it's a. Or just comment on the video. Or just comment on the video, whether it's like what, something you want us to talk about, if you want it to be more anonymous. Yeah. Whatever, yeah, just send us an email. I mean, everything everything we receive over email will be completely confidential. Oh. Oh, Meagle. Oh, yes. We are planning. Okay. We are, go we are planning since tonight. I'm sorry. I will go on video chat tonight, guys, but... I'm exhausted since I haven't slept in about two weeks. What, how about we do it earlier than we normally do, and we'll do it then? Okay. All right, yeah, that's well, it wouldn't be as interesting then. Yeah, it should be. someone's going to be awake. All right, yeah, we'll do it then. What we'll do is, um, we are going to do a web show. Should we go short first? Yeah, let's. Well, we are going to go on Omegle. Nah. Tee hee. So, yeah, if you want to come in, um, not sure on specific times, probably be around 8.30 to 9-ish. Yeah. Oh, but right, we'll, like, we'll, we'll post a warning. We'll, we'll post a warning, so yeah. We'll give you a 10-minute warning because we'll have to talk it out for a bit. Yeah. And what we'll do is, I mean, if you subscribe to us, then just when you're on YouTube, you should get a little ping. thing. Ping. Ping. As we say bing. it, bing, 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 bad having. Sorry, <laughs> obsessed with friends here. Yeah. Uh, David Trimmer, love you. <laughs> um, that's Ross for any of you that don't know. <laughs> and that's. And. All the guys are cute and friends. Actually, they all are. They oh, are. Why are there so many cats? They are all cute. But shout out to. <laughs> shout out to David Trimmer because, like. I just love you. And as for you, Chandler, I love your personality. And Joey, you're like the awesomest. You're just like, I want you to be my best friend. Yeah. That's for the other two. <laughs> um, no offence, Joey. It's just like, you're too cute. <laughs> and you're out of my league. <laughs> um, and as for the girls, Jennifer Aniston. Sorry. <laughs> No, Remember Phoebe, what we said? Phoebe's All right, personality. Phoebe. Phoebe's personality, but Jennifer yeah, Aniston, yeah. you have a nice part. What is Phoebe's name? Uh, what's her real name? Uh, uh, what is her name? Because Monica's Courtney Cox. Then Jennifer Aniston and. What's your name, Phoebe? Someone comment with Phoebe's name. Comment. Yeah, we'll add it to the description or something. Or we'll do like a quick solo video of one of us saying, Phoebe is Phoebe's! Wait, I'm finding out now. Well, I'm going to probably go stupidly slow. Alright, well. Um. We're going let's think. Ah, uh, what else have we got? Oh, I've got your. Oh, yeah. By the way, this is like quite a random one. But, Ross and Rachel argument. Everyone knows the Ross and Rachel argument. If you don't, we'll give you a quick summary. Okay. Ross and Rachel are seeing each other. I think this is like series two kind of time. Yeah. Series two or three. They're seeing each other. They're like really happy together. Then Rachel gets a new job. She's working with a fit guy. Ross starts to get a little bit jealous. Which jealousy on guys is cute. Yeah. But he kind of gets a bit possessive. So he starts sending us stuff to the it's office. Not cute. And he starts going there all the time and, like, leaving our voicemails every five minutes. That's not cute. That's just stalkerish. Okay? That's, like... Yeah. So, completely right, and everyone agrees on this, she just tells him, back off. Considering the thick guy she works with is just her friend. Now, when they argue about this, 
she asks to go on a break. Remember that, they are on a break. On a break. Ross then calls her later that evening while he's out at a pub, and she has the guy that he was suspicious of round her house consoling her. So, there's a cat there or something. Yeah, we'll a continue cat. in a second because we're avoiding a cat. Hello! Yes, thank you! They want the cats. They want the cats. We're talking to people we know. <laughs> um, ah. So, then, uh, Ross basically has a quick one night stand with some random slut he meets at the bar. Well, he already knew her, but like, you know, randomly, one night, no motions, just, yeah. just basically to get back at Rachel. Alright? Rachel then calls him the next morning. Saying that, like... She, she wants to... Oh! Ah. <laughs> I'm sorry, just untangling. So she calls him. Sammy? Yeah. So she calls, she calls him. She like says that she wants to like try and sort it all this like, all of this out. She wants to like get back together with him. And so then Ross freaks and because she's still in the, the one night stand girl still in his apartment. And like so then Rachel comes round and Ross still has this girl in his apartment. So she's hiding behind the door and sneaks out while. Yeah. I can't remember, are they hugging or snogging? Ah, uh, hugging. Hugging. Um. When Rachel finds out due to a stupidly long connection. Yeah, so it was something like. It was like her brother to Phoebe's friend to, to Gunther who fancies. Who, to Phoebe's friend's roommate who's Gunther who fancies Rachel to Rachel. Rachel finds out and Rachel accuses him of cheating. Alright, my personal opinion is they're on a break. It's fine. fine. People may disagree. And yeah. Just give us give us your responses to that actually. That could be quite a controversial argument. Yeah, we know those people over there. If you can see them. Those people there. Hi Josh! Yeah. Okay. Lester. Lester and Declan. Wait, what are you doing? Right, we're going to go do the responsible thing and go see what they're doing. Yes, we are. So we're going to go off now. Uh, we love you. All right, we'll leave it on for a minute. This may be interesting, that's why. So crossing a massive road. We're in a triangle now. Yeah, triangle. 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 Out of the triangle now. Wait, what are you doing? Just say hello to our viewers. Yes, yeah, say hello. Say hello to our viewers. You are going to You are YouTube. now on, on okay. our YouTube webcast oh. thing. <laughs> are you Congratulations. Doing? Yeah, we have been doing it for a while. Are going to be on YouTube? Say hello to our viewers. Oh, wow. We're going to be on YouTube. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is her little this brother's dog? friend. This is yeah. my dog, Alfie. I'm bloody scared of that dog. Just reckon he's fine. He's more scared of you. Yeah. <laughs> Alfie's a major wuss. Josh, Misty's more violent than Alfie. Yeah. Alfie's a major wuss. If anything, what box, is it? Boxer cross Staffy. There, there's Declan. Yeah. Say hi, Declan. Hi. You're going to be on YouTube. Congratulations. Look at my... So, oh, you I pulled that collar kind of for this new Because we're doing yes, a web show did. thing. What for? How long is that dog? 18 months. What are you doing? So, yeah, what are you doing? I think we're doing. Doggy! Why don't you just go to the park? Like, <laughs> Why don't you just go to the park? I'm fucking wild like fucking man. I'm really scared. I'm really scared. It's just because he's hyper. Where did you start doing that? 40 minutes ago. Where were you putting? Uh, over there. there. We were at my house when we started doing it. Yeah. Why aren't you going to be on YouTube? 
Yeah. Well, actually, take a proper conclusion. What, did you go down Hog Slate? Yeah. It took you in that? minutes to do that. Never went down Hog Slate. We walked right down. I'm going to keep stopping. I'm going to stop on the side of the and we've got loads of cars and stuff. Alright, we best get going, actually. <laughs> yeah. Alright, behave, boys. Don't get yourselves <laughs> killed. Be sensible. We should cross. We should cross again. Yeah, we can. keep walking for now. Okay. Um, oh yeah, so congratulations, you just met her little brother's friends. Yeah. You can meet my little brother and his friends again soon, but we call my little brother and his friends Jesus and his disciples. Because this is like that. He's like a freaking, like, neither. He's like, he has a following. You it's scary because we're like, like social outcasts. I know. And my brother's like popular. Yeah. That is pretty much the group that we are in at school. What? Social outcasts. Yeah, we literally are. It's like us and a couple of other people. It's just like, we're like the nobodies. We all have like friends that are popular, but that's it. Well, I don't. You do wish. Sophie Martin has sent me a message. There we go. That's Sophie, Sophie Martin's popular. Alfie, oh, you can't run Sophie. on the road. I've asked Sophie to come on Saturday. To what? Saturday. Hopefully. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, then Callum can come. Huh? Callum. Callum Vernon wants to come. Cool, so then we've got an even number. Even number. We're, not going, we're not going without an even number. <laughs> yeah. Is it right? Oh my god. What? Ooh, oh my god, yeah, that would work. Sorry, we just had a relationship idea. Yeah. Relationship <laughs> inspiration. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to have to ask him if it's all right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that may be a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so... So, yeah! Oh, I'm going to repeat what I said a few episodes ago. Teachers, if you ever see this, lay off the homework. That's so much. I had last night to do, okay? 63 questions on negative fractional indices. I had two pieces of science. Uh, maths, arts, uh, English. Um, I had English, art. Yeah, what was the other lesson? Uh, which is like, it's like too much French. Oh yeah, I have French as well for tomorrow. Well, oh. Oh, I hate French. I like French. I hate French. Can you do my French homework for me? Yeah, I actually will. I love French. Yeah, well, I'm already apparently like the number one person in the class. Which I am, so I am in mine. No, so. I, I kind of am. Because I got 9 out of 10 on a test that we did, which was like the highest out of everyone. So which did I. Well, I'm, like, I'm not eight in my I class. I cheated. Don't cheat! I didn't cheat and I'm the highest! Sorry, I like being a nerd. I am a nerd. Yeah, don't cheat on things like French. Yeah. Even though it's never gonna be useful to me. There's a dog. Nope, there's a vet. I am being dragged. I am being dragged. Come on, Alfie! Okay. Alright, we have a 43 minute, 44 minute video now. Wow, I bet you guys are really going to watch this. Alright, so we're going to go off now because it's getting a bit long. And um, what we're going to do really? is... It's only just getting a bit long. We're going to start doing shorter videos like... We'll try to. Yeah, and we'll... It's supposed to be quite short. Yeah. And we ended up going on. What we're going to do is we're going to try doing some slightly shorter videos. On. We might end up doing a few more. What we'll do is... Our titles will be a bit random, but if you read the descriptions, it'll kind of say what we're talking about, so you can decide exactly what yeah, you want to... Yeah, don't get excited. Yeah, just don't. don't get excited, because our titles will be random, but if you have a look at the descriptions, you'll know what's in them, and then you can decide whether it's what you want to watch or not. But, but yeah. you will want to watch. Which you will. You will. And if you do have <laughs> any... Oh, yes. Yeah, we are. Now, if you do have any suggestions, I'm not joking, comment, email, anything, okay? Communicate 
Anyway, we now have a Facebook page. So like us. Like us, please. We love you if you like us. We are orange, orange green, green, blue, purple. purple. The same as our YouTube. I think there's a higher from between the blue and the purple because but Google. Not on, not on, there isn't on Facebook. Isn't there? No. All right, yeah, well, yeah. The reason we have a hyphen on Google is because apparently second names can't have spaces in them. Which I think is stupid. Second names should be allowed to have spaces in them. All right, so we're going to go now. We love you all. We love you. Please we subscribe. We love you. Please subscribe. Like follow us. us. Like us. Whatever it is that you Depends can do. Better. Yeah. All right. We love you. Bye. Bye.